there is this supplement that is called glucose tolerant factor or mineral. This mineral can actually help you to improve your outcomes in diabetes. For, for somebody who has been diagnosed with uh, diabetes and specifically type 2 diabetes, remember your sensitivity to insulin has reduced. Therefore, your ability to pump glucose from blood into the cells is limited. So if you want to pump glucose from blood into the cells, brain cells, muscle cells, liver cells, you need insulin to be sensitive to the cells so that you can actually open them up so that this glucose flows from blood into these cells. That supplement is actually called chromium and it comes in a very good form called chromium picolinate. So if you are intending to uh, reverse your outcomes uh, of diabetes, as you fix what you need to fix, the kitchen and the lifestyle and exercise and fasting, this supplement can actually come in handy for you. Now, this is not me telling you that this is a supplement that is now new, the new therapy that you can actually just go and jump on it and use it to reverse diabetes. That is not going to happen. Why? Because diabetes is a chronic carbohydrate intake disease. So you need to do your work in the kitchen. You need to change that kitchen. You start fasting, you eat healthy, you exercise, you sleep well, and then now you can supplement. They are called supplements because they supplement what you don't have. These supplements are also uh, in diets, but because you are diabetic already or you've been diagnosed with diabetes, that will pose a challenge. So you actually need uh, them as you edit your lifestyle. And they're supposed to be used for about two to three months, a short period of time. Why? Because they are not the solution. <laughs> they are supplements. Okay, the solution is in your kitchen. So as you fix the kitchen, as you fix your lifestyle, you can actually use them. About 200 to uh, 400 micrograms every single day can actually improve your outcomes in diabetes. Why? Because chromium is a micro micro mineral or micro element that actually improves sensitivity of insulin to the cells so it actually improves the activity of insulin which is opening up the cells the muscle cells the brain cells the liver cells and the fat cells to improve glucose flow into these cells for utilization or for storage so chromium plays that role of improving the insulin sensitivity to the cells however if you've been diagnosed with type 2 diabetes, that tells you your stores are already full. Your fat cells are filled with glucose. You're not able to utilize it. So the worst thing you can do is to actually pump in more glucose into the already filled stores. You see that? You see the challenge? So the challenge means, uh, the challenge comes in this way. Chromium will actually improve your supply of glucose from the blood into the cells. But your cells are already uh, built up with a lot of glucose, which you need to empty for you to recover from diabetes. Therefore, this is the reason why you're using these supplements for a short period of time. As you improve insulin sensitivity, you're fixing the kitchen, you're fixing the lifestyle, you're fasting, you're exercising, you're combining all this in form of holistic approach, and then you combine the supplement meanwhile as you do what you have to do. So do not think that these supplements are coming in uh, and this is the new power in the reverse soul of diabetes. No. Diabetes is reversible, but it can only be reversed through what caused it, and that is chronic consumption of carbohydrates. I thought you should know.